we're going to cover the topic of technical literacy for the Olympic weightlifting movements and we're going to start right now. What's up everybody, it's Dan Miller from GarageStrength.com and if this is your first time to the channel and you're interested in becoming an athletic freak, you want to get stronger, you want to be more explosive, you want to have better speed on that field, maybe you want to be a more proficient Olympic weightlifter, make sure that you like, subscribe, and you ring that notification bell so we can help you become a champion. So over the last 10 years at Garage Strength, we've had Olympic weightlifters make every single youth junior and senior level international team from youth Pan Ams to senior Pan Ams, from youth worlds to senior worlds. We've even had medalists at the youth and junior world championship level. And a lot of this success has been attributed to, one, the environment we have, the culture we have here at Garage Strength, the knowledge and the information that we've been able to learn and pass on by spending time with Zygmunt, spending time with Norik Vardanian, studying the sport and being around guys like Piros Dimas on a regular basis. But some of this also comes down to the concept of technical literacy. So first, what exactly is technical literacy? If we can think about it, technical literacy is having athletes, having Olympic weightlifters that can comprehend tech Unique. They can comprehend what they need to do off the floor to the knee, what they need to do through no man's land into that reciprocation point. They understand what needs to happen when the bar gets into their hip and when they're getting into the catch position. They know exactly what they need to feel in the positions they need to hit when they're achieving a split jerk or a power jerk, whatever it might be. So it's very, very important to understand the importance behind technical literacy. It's, we, as Olympic weightlifters, we need to remember that having those three key elements, strength, technique, mobility, all three of those aspects are extremely important. But when we have technical literacy, now we can utilize that literacy to improve our strength, to improve our mobility. So why is it important? Oftentimes athletes just come in, they passively go through the motions. They just listen to the coach and don't question anything and they just go through the program for the day and they never truly engage in that learning. And that's okay, especially with intermediate and novice weightlifters, it's important to just get those reps in. It's important to just go through the program. But there comes a time when feeling and muscle proposition have to start to unite and there has to be these technical epiphanies because then the athlete is capable of learning the feelings that they need to achieve at a much faster rate at a much more precise positioning and they can utilize the strength that they've gained over the last couple years to execute as precisely as possible so it's important to learn different aspects of technique in the snatch, of technique in the clean and jerk. It's important to utilize variations and to utilize different strength movements to stimulate different adaptations and different feelings because that is where the carryover is gonna be. As Olympic weightlifting coaches, we get so hung up in what are our athletes back squatting? What are they front squatting? But we forget that there's much more to the platform. There's much more to competition. And when you have an athlete that is fully bought into being technically literate, they can make changes in their movement during a lift. Oftentimes you can see some very, very advanced weightlifters. We've got one right here at Garage Strength, two-time national champion, senior Pan American team member, Jacob Horse. If he pulls and that bar is slightly forward, he knows he needs to drive his knees forward a little bit more while holding the heels grounded. He understands how to reciprocate his knees a little bit deeper if he wasn't in that good position off the floor. And that's enabled him to have that repetitive ability to hit multiple singles over 125 kilos in the snatch when he's only a 67K weightlifter. He's been able to snatch 134 kilos because he's comprehending technical literacy. And as he ages and as our other elite weightlifters age, it's very important that we continuously develop their technical literacy so any strength that they gain in their programming leads to more optimized movement on the platform. So embrace that technical literacy, learn different positions using variations, learn different feelings, 
recognize those important adaptations to improve your technique, improve your strength, and enhance your mobility. Try to embrace that, try to put that into your own training program. If you need help with your training program, you can head over to garagestrength.com and you can pick up our parabolic periodization course and book, or if you want programming, you can pick up a pro program directly from garagestrength.com. If you want more information about Olympic weightlifting, you can click on this video right here. Until next time, guys, peace.